Sean Terrell here with Merrill Lyric Opera. In the midst of preparing the next Taste Merrill Lyric Opera, we lost one of the greats of classical music, pianist, conductor, teacher, mentor, Leon Fleischer. We at Merrill Lyric Opera encourage you to watch a tribute to Leon Fleischer by his students on Facebook. There you will hear from dozens of his students, both playing and reminiscing about the profound impact Mr. Fleischer had on their musical lives. For a further look into the mind and music of Leon Fleischer, tune into the revelatory series, Listening for Truth. Hi friends, Sean Terrell here with the next Taste of Maryland Lyric Opera. This week, we would like to share with you selections from the orchestral debut of the Maryland Lyric Opera Orchestra at the Strathmore Hall last November. We were honored to have the legendary American pianist Leon Fleischer as soloist in a performance of Mozart's Concerto No. 12 in A Major. At the young age of 91, he mesmerized both the orchestra and the audience with his profound artistry. Before we get to some of these highlights, we'd like to bring you up to date on several things we've done since the start of the pandemic. Just a few weeks ago, Merrill and Lyric Opera gave their first performance in the time of COVID for our local healthcare heroes at the Suburban Hospital in Bethesda. The event was outdoors with the performers at a safe distance and all the doctors, nurses, and staff were wearing masks, of course. Merrill and Lyric Opera delivered a much needed study break with great performances from soprano Man Lee Dung, pianist Christopher Kultzer, tenor Yi Lee, and baritone Javier Array. Great stuff. Merrill Lyric Opera has also started a new video blog on our Facebook page called In Conversation with Merrill and Lyric Opera. Check out our first three-part installment as we delve into the brilliant mind and antics of baritone Mark Delavan. Believe it or not, you'll even get to hear some Neil Diamond. In case you missed some of our earlier posts on the Mask Initiative, Merrill and Lyric Opera, through the generous support of Brad Clark, our founder and artistic director, delivered some 450,000 surgical masks to area hospitals and outreach centers. Please take a look at our newly released website under In the Community for a list of the organizations that receive PPE from Merrill and Eric Opera, along with some pictures and a poignant video set to the music of Puccini. Spend some time exploring our new website and please find your way to the Support Us tab. If you like some of the things Merrill and Eric Opera is doing and are able to make a donation, we will be incredibly grateful and we'll make sure it gets to the artists whose careers have all but come to a complete standstill. Now back to the music. We start with Claude Debussy's evocative, sensuous prelude to an afternoon of a fawn, followed by the colossal, triumphant Symphony No. 2 of Jean Sibelius. On the podium, once again, is our music director, Louis Salemno, and in front of him, the glorious sound of the Maryland Lyric Opera Orchestra. We hope you enjoy it. See you next time. Thanks. <laughs>